me, sparkly. So I decided to do an impromptu day in the life because I actually, it's time to get, okay? It's time to get, it's time to get, it's just time to get. So I know y'all tired of looking at me ugly. And, for, and I swear I'd be cute, but for some reason, every time I decide to vlog, I'd be ugly. Like, I got a brand new fresh wig in there. I got me some fresh lashes, and I look like this. But wait, before we start, these bonnets are now on the site. They just arrived this morning. They basically protect your hair and your edges at the same time. It has the built-in um, edge scarf, you know. Really nice. They're on the site, so go ahead and purchase. I know I tie weird. I have very, very long nails. You gotta do what you gotta do. Yes, it is very tight, like, ain't going nowhere. Because if you like me, you don't like keeping up with a scarf and a bonnet. It's one or the other. So anyway, um, I am moving. I'm moving out of Florida in about 18 days. Today is the 10th. I went on the 28th. I leave on the 27th though. So I've just been trying to get my life together. Did they not dump my trash? Hold on. We might have a fucking issue here. But we, um... What was I saying? Um, yeah, I'm just trying to get my life together. I have, like, if you, I really should have showed y'all. My room was horrible. And I'm not going to lie. Don't judge me here, y'all. Please don't judge me. But I have not fully washed, like, all my clothes since, like, last June. <laughs> it is freaking April. No, it's May 2021. I haven't washed my clothes all my clothes in damn near a year i know it's so fucking sad and it's because i have a lot of stuff and i kind of wash as i go like i'll wash like undergarments night clothes and just like little clothes that i'm gonna wear but i've never washed all the clothes which if you think about it that means i just have shit that i clearly don't wear if i haven't washed all the clothes which means i needed to get rid of it anyway so that's what i did last night i was dragging out big tubs of stuff and putting it in a car and taking it across the street to the to the business that i live across from and dumping it in their trash because the trash can't come today. The trash man come today. And normally I'll schedule a trash pickup, but I wanted that shit like out. Like I ain't even I don't like trash sitting in front of my house. I don't want to wait. I just took it out. So that was very stressful, but I didn't break a nail. It's okay. So today on the agenda, um, I'm on my way to drop off. This is the first load. I really thought all my clothes, I'm like, oh yeah, they probably can. I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna just fold up all my clothes. It should all fit in here. That's a no. So this is just the, the dark clothes. And I throw away everything that I'm dark, that I don't want. This is the stuff that I do want. Which I'm probably gonna go through it again when I move and be like, you know what? I don't need this shit. Okay, I'm rambling. I'm rambling. After that, you know, I'm so we getting the clothes together, we getting the house together. My sister's moving to my house, so I don't have to get too much stuff out. But um, you know, I just gotta clean it. You know, just gotta clean it. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, like the couch, some of the couches are staying. The kitchen table is probably staying. I'm still debating about my bed set because the look that I'm going for in my new house. Just that the bed set don't really go with that. So I don't know. I'm still debating about that, but a lot of the stuff is staying. Um. So yeah, we just really getting the house together i have a I've ordered a package and ship out today um i need to take product pictures for these i need to do my hair i need to slap my wig back on so we're gonna have a pretty long fulfilling vlog hopefully i can keep up but come on
okay so now that that's out of the way let's go work out and i have been filming my fitness journey since i started like three weeks ago and i'll post that when i finish i guess by the time i leave is when i finish and that's in like two more weeks so and it's really just my fitness journey period like I ain't, I'm I don't, I ain't, I'm not tired. I don't. I'm not supposed to be working out today anyway. I only work out Tuesday through Friday. Sometimes Saturday, maybe a little Sunday, like on my own. But Tuesdays and Friday, I train. But whatever. The more the merrier. Huh? I'm not really in a workout mood. Like I'm kind of busy. Like, but let's just get over with. <sighs> I'm exhausted, and y'all, I don't actually go out in bonnets. I just. It's early. I have shit to do, okay? And I'm on a bind, so. Hold on. Is this, is this that boy? I'm not getting out. He yeah, always train the stupid boys. Who the hell is that? <laughs> yeah, no, I don't like people. Let's get this over with. I'm not going to be no later than 12. Why would you say 10.30? Why would I say 10.30 if I never said 10.30? No, I'm saying is, you said you was coming before 12. Don't hear this. Say hi to my vlog. Yo, who? My vlog. Hey, vlog. Don't hear this bull. Uh, see, I'm here on my day off, and he don't even want to train me. I do. I just said come back at 10.30. I can't make no promises. Then you can come back at 10.30. All right. Come back at 10.30. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna come back because I'm dedicated. But listen, when I, I need to get gas. I'm tired. Because cool, yeah, that y'all really don't like me. Like, y'all don't like me because if y'all did, y'all would go to my website and get some merch. Let me just give y'all a little, little tour. Let it load, let it load. Okay. So we have the sparkly face mask. We have these bonnets that I just told y'all about. We have these crop tops in two different colors. Super freaking cute. Small to extra large. We got the waist trainers, our top sellers. Listen, please refer to this size chart because there are no refunds or exchanges due to COVID-19. Once it reaches you, you may not give it back. Now it's different if something came to you broken or whatever or a mistake that I made, then yeah. But just because you ordered the wrong size, I can't, you know, I can't accommodate that. That's not my fault. Size is small to 6'6". Like people that live here, they just think that, oh, she lives here. So Y'all wouldn't do that to Walmart. If Walmart said no refund or Gucci said no refund, you're, you're gonna, you know, deal with it. Sell it to somebody else or just deal with it. Like, you're not going, oh, I'm going to, I'm just going to ask them. Even though they said no, I'm just going to ask. No, it's not fair. Like, nobody's going to tell me how to run my business. That's the most, like, craziest thing ever to me. These are the lash kits. This is a sparkle lash kit. Sparkle are so pretty. Eventually, I'm going to move over to Shopify. Shopify is so, like, Raw. Everybody who website is through Shopify, I'd be like, wow, that's so pretty. These are the sweat sticks. These sweat sticks really work, y'all. Y'all will see in my um fitness vlog, my fitness journey, because I you literally wear this every time I work out this and the waist trainer. I didn't today because I just didn't feel like it, but this sweat stick really does it to you. The more you sweat, the more it burns. It's burning all of that set off. Got the teddy bear slippers. Y'all, I love these. So one size fits. Um a five to ten in adult. Somebody asked about eleven. I'm really not sure because I don't have an eleven size foot. But these pictures look kind of because of the background. They look. Why they look dirty? <laughs> Y'all, I promise they not dirty. It's just how it look. <laughs> oh my god! I need to change these last two pictures. They look filthy, but they're not. I promise. <laughs> we have this face mask the icy that's the one y'all just saw me went on this is my favorite it's so pretty
AirPod cases, the Hennessy one, the baby lotion, the Starbucks case with the keychain. I have one large corset style waist room. And these ones are really good for like after you had a baby or after surgery um, because it's corset style. And it's just one large look. It's on sale for $45. I might take it down a little more. But then we have these simple, simple two pieces. These are just stuff that I had left over from like my last batch. I have like select colors and sizes. So you have to just kind of go through them and see, you know, like let's say you wear a medium. Only thing we have in a medium is blue, burgundy, and black. Let's say you wear extra large. Only thing we have in an extra large is red and burgundy. So it's like that. Ooh. Then we have these branded two pieces. These are really, really good for workout. And they're so cute. Look at the back of it. I love these ones. And BSR is like a, uh, it's like a sister brand to our brand. It's like our family brand. Like that's the brand of my, that's my, the name of my dad, Jim and everything. Same with the waist of thigh burner. It's BSR, but that's still part of my brand. And these are really good. They work really good with the sweat sticks as well. I would suggest those for people that are actually trying to lose weight and not necessarily like shape their waist. But like, let's say you go walk around a park every day. I would suggest that for them. People that just can't do the waist training thing. Cause waist training is really, it's a lot. Like. Um, we have these face masks, glitz. We have these butterfly anklets. They are on sale for $7. Very pretty. We have the arm bands. They work with the sweat stick as well. It helps burn fat on the arms during the workout. And then we have the stuff that's in the sparkle treasure chest, which is baby shoes. Most of these are a size two. I think one is a size one and one is a size three. Can't remember which ones, but go through them. More baby shoes. So yes, y'all like go shop. I have four different types of lashes. And with the lash kits, you can get, like you basically can't get lashes separately, but if you get one kit, you can get extra pairs of lashes. So let's say you want the cotton lash kit, right? You could just get the cotton lash kit or cotton lash kit plus, oh, I think I want some sparkle too. Then you put cotton lash kit plus additional pair. In the notes where you check out, you'll put sparkle lashes or additional pair, sparkle, or whatever. And you can do up to three different pairs because obviously it's four different types. <coughs> and just you just have to put it in the notes which extra pair you want. I really like cotton, these are very pretty. Sorry, my nose, these are lovely. These are so cute. <laughs> And pink is, I think, my favorite. Where is it? <laughs> pink? Hi, where's pink? Hi, lovely. Pink. <laughs> Pretty. But yes, y'all, go shop. Sparkly.com. Sparkly.com. Very, very, very fast shipping. Use the code GRAND at checkout. <laughs> for 15% off. You know what, cause clearly, oh, clearly you already uh, on the BS and you don't want to train me. I so, was sleeping, sorry. You were not. I was sleeping with my eyes open, day. You were like, I, 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 I can't. Oh. Y'all, I work out to people. What? I'm talking to my vlog. I haven't watched Put clothes. Put me on your vlog, cause I need to tell them. Hi. Hello. That's it? Yes. <laughs>
day wasn't my workout day, so my body just wasn't ready. Like, and honestly, I all, I normally take it serious. Y'all will see in my um fitness journey, I take it very seriously. I thought turning the camera off, I took it a little more seriously. But <sighs> skipping days really is not good. Like, uh, like people that work out three days a week, I don't see how y'all do it because I miss. I skip one or two days like the weekend, and I just can't even. Oh my god. And then I'm uncomfortable. I'm gonna go home and take a shower, throw on my wig and hat. Cause my clothes still got like 20 more minutes. And do that. Cause I still need to go to the store and get hair stuff. I need to get mousse and shit like that. So let's go do that. I'm so tired. Oh my God. In my head hot. I gotta get out. I gotta go. And I need gas. I gotta go. Whew, tomorrow is legs and glutes and abs i like i prefer to work on that stuff i love working on that stuff oh, oh shit i just keep wasting drink in here but yeah y'all all right so i can't see so i took me a shower slapped my wig on with a hat and i told y'all still gotta do my damn hair that was some lashes and I just threw on something because all my damn clothes is being washed because recently I had a I'm inserted the clip but recently I had a really bad leak and a lot of my stuff was just damaged and then on top of that I've been told y'all I've been needed to wash clothes and I just wasn't ready to take a handle on that stuff so some stuff was actually damaged some stuff just needed to be washed but overall everything kind of just mixed in together so I don't really have a lot of clothes and able to wear so i'm gonna go get gas and go pick up my clothes um i have a few errands around i just need to get i already said get gas i need to ship off an order i could do that before four o'clock i need to go get hydrogen peroxide and something else i don't know but those are two things i need to do right now so after i get my clothes you know i run my little errands and then i'll go home and start packing. And I have two big suitcases, two medium ones, and then I have that big tub. And hopefully, I think I can fit all my clothes in that stuff or whatever. And like I said, I'll just leave out just simple stuff. Cause I don't wear clothes. I don't really go anywhere. Just leave out like, you know, a couple outfits. Keep me from digging, digging into that stuff. Cause I, I ain't trying to. Nicely and organize it and shit like that. So let's just see how that goes. So today I really need to be spending time at home. I also need to film a video. It's a video I need to film like ASAP. I'll probably put it out before I put out this though because that's just how urgent it is. My business um, essential video. On top of that, I'm adding like different clips for me fulfilling orders and stay. They in my way. I need. <laughs> I'm so tired of putting gas in this car. I just put gas in here like two, three days ago. Like filled up. But yeah, so I will call y'all back. So let me give y'all a life hack real quick. <laughs> if you, hold on now. If you wear long nails, right? And y'all know the whole issue with getting your car out, especially at the gas pump, whatever. Here's what I do. I only go to gas stations that have the tap thing so I can just tap my car <laughs> and go because I'm not gonna be sitting there fighting with the damn thing I'm not doing it and I'm not going inside and also that's more security sticking it in there anyway because of those little duplicate card reader things you're just tapping it so technically it can't like you know so that's just a little life hack that's what I'm doing right now trying to find me a goddamn which I know Wawa's do I know all Wawa's do um so um, I swear, ever since I got a BMW, I just see BMWs everywhere. Like, literally everywhere. That's crazy. But yeah, so I'm looking for me a gas station. And then sometimes I just suck it up and go inside. But I don't got time. I got 13 miles left. I need a gas station now. Oh, look at the kids. Like one of my old dancers. All right, gotta go. Mm -hmm.
customer, is that personal connection. You know, it's, it's nice. I'm gonna go give me a CL8 from Chick fil A. I really want macaroni, but I'm trying to do better. Shut the hell up! Bro, all this car do it. All this car do is beep, and in a way, I appreciate it because you let me know what's going on. But you ain't gotta keep beeping. You do not have to keep doing that. Ooh. Sorry. But yeah, y'all, I'm just so excited for what I have in store. Um, like I said, moving to a different state is so different from moving, you know, somewhere else within the area, you know, like moving from here to an apartment complex or somewhere, just somewhere around here, even if it ain't that close, just somewhere in the state, period. Like, I'm moving 12 hours away. My new house is 12 hours and 12 minutes away from where I live right now. And I'm not gonna lie, and this is only between me and y'all because... I be, I be lying when people ask me where I'm going. I always tell them Texas. <laughs> I'm not going to Texas. I'm literally going on the opposite side of the world. But let me tell you why I lie though. Um, the, the, the place that I'm from, people literally don't have their own minds. And I don't want nobody to be following me. And, and not even just like that, just because like, like just like one person to go on vacation to Houston. When I tell you the whole city will go to Houston, the one person will go to Atlanta. Everybody's gonna go to Atlanta. Everybody. Like, and it's just so it's like they oh, they moved to such and such. Oh, I'm gonna move there too. I don't I'm moving away for a reason, not for y'all to come. So yeah, that's the case. But eventually I will reveal where I'm at. Um if y'all want to know, y'all can ask me. But, like, when people be asking me on Instagram where everybody can see, I be lying. But, you know, if you want to know, ask me. Because we might be in the same city and we might be friends, period. But where I'm moving is a really, really, really nice place. It's a nice state. It's very close to, like, it's literally, like, three hours away from all the main, like, places. Like, I don't know how far it is from Texas, for real. But it's, like, a couple, like, three or four hours away from Atlanta, three four hours away from this place like literally like that like so i'm really just i'm ready you know like i said my mom is going to we're not going together she's moving to her own place and i at this point i might be moving before her but either way i'm going i told her that like <laughs> i'm going my mind is set y'all my place is already paid for the positive stuff already paid for i gotta sign the lease like a couple days before i go whatever and i just feel like the vlogs are going to be so amazing because it's going to be so much to do like being that i'm in a new area i can literally vlog me doing anything because it's new i'm taking all three of my dogs and that's just that on that we're we're getting the hell up out of here and i'm so happy i will be back in florida at least once a month to get my nails thing because i'm not leaving my nails set behind <laughs> But yeah, I'm really excited and I'm so happy because I prayed for this, y'all. Like, like I was to a point where everything was just going wrong. Um, I had to reschedule my surgery, but I don't think I'm gonna get it anymore because I think I appreciate it more by working out. I'm still gonna get my boobs done one day, but I'm not in a rush. But I'm not, you know, I'm not gonna go through that. I'm not gonna put my body through that again when I can just work out. Like, so yeah that's that so that went wrong and then after that i just kept getting denied by a bunch of houses and apartment complexes on top of that i was kind of picky like i don't want to i didn't want to live in apartments and if i did live in a, if i found a house i wanted granite countertops um you know not new cabinets uh, 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 stainless steel appliances I was very particular about stuff like that I really didn't want no carpet none of that like so it was just like and then I needed like you know a backyard or something for the dogs I was just you know and I needed at least two bedrooms preferably three I live in a three now and I'm making it work I need all of my bedrooms and I just kept getting denied for no reason at all like I literally have nothing on my background no nothing no evictions no bad rental history um i make the efficient amount of money you know like it wasn't nothing they didn't have no reason to be denying me and y'all i apply i said let me just suck it up and just apply for this apartment complex but it's like apartments and townhouses and a townhouse is is a it's a lot different than an apartment so i applied on a monday 
Monday morning. She wrote me, she texted me Monday afternoon at five. The next morning she told me that it's being reviewed at nine o'clock. By 10.30, I was approved. I said, all this damn time. <laughs> and I was trying to move May 1st, but what I wanted wasn't available until um, the end of May, which is cool. And at first I was gonna do a two in, a two in two, I think. And she said, um, she ended up finding a three bedroom, one, oh my God. Three bedroom, one full bath and two half baths. I'm like, I'll take that. It was only like $200 more. My rent is uh, like $1,100 for that. Upstairs, downstairs, it's final downstairs, carpet upstairs. I don't really know how I feel about that, but I can paint the walls. They got wash and dryer hookups, all the goods. So I'm like, yeah, damn, I need to get over. I need to get over. I don't want to bomb rush anybody, but thanks. But yeah, y'all. So it's just, it was just, it's just perfect. Like I haven't seen it yet, and I think that's really a, you know, I can say a good thing. But that's like so, you know, um, adventurous. Like I see it the first time when I go. Like <laughs> so, yes, y'all. And I got proof of my car the same we got proof for my house. Like I got proof of the car on a Tuesday. I got proof of the no, I got a proof of the car on a Monday. And I got a proof of the house on Tuesday. I'm like, wow. Like, so like I said, everything is paid for. Everything is good. Everything is great. We are going. Only thing I still need to do is call Spectrum and end my service here and start it there. I already ended service with Duke and the water people and started it there um, the day that I go. And I need to, my mom need to give me the information about the pods. The, um, I need to get a pod and I need the information about getting my car transported because once I leave, I'm not coming back. Like we leave on the 27th and I get the keys on the 28th. I'm not trying to come back. Like that's the one I'm trying to leave. If my stuff arrive a little later, well, at least if my stuff arrive, you know, a day or two later, that's cool. My car need to be there. It take them like two days to get it there. My car needs to be there when I get there, though. But yes, y'all, I'm so happy. I'm gonna, you know, actually break down, um, break down how everything went, the total cost, because people actually think it's a big, like it's really a big deal moving out of the state. It's really not. And you know, I got my own, you know, my little stuff going on. So I don't plan on working, but I think I want to do home health just for like two months a month or so just because you know until i get new to the area I mean, until i can get used to the area or whatever but i haven't decided yet but you know i always hear about business i ain't worked a real job since like i can't even say since november because it really didn't count i worked for like two weeks in november a real real job like on somebody clocks since last june it's may it's gonna be june again so it's been a whole year since i actually been on the clock on the clock like and I've been handling it, okay? I've been motherfucking handling it. And I'm so proud of myself. Because I'm only 22. But yeah, I was just, I just wanted to talk to you guys. Car conversations. <laughs> but yes, oh my goodness. I can't wait. The vlogs are going to be amazing. And then also, I was thinking like, I have so much potential. Like, I've been watching other, it's just, uh, it's a couple of YouTubers that I just started watching. I'm like, wow. Like, they remind me so much of me. Like, and I see why y'all be just so entertaining, like, just with my everyday life. It is entertaining for people that were, like, made for this. You get what I'm saying? Like, we could just be doing anything and y'all will literally be, y'all literally be happy with the vlog because it's us. And now I see, and I said, you know what? I have so much potential. Like, and she kind of inspired me. She kind of inspired me. And I'm like, you know what? I need to take this seriously, for real, because I have so much potential, and then it's like all the stuff that I be wanting to do, like I want to do partnerships with Fashion Nova and hair reviews, you know, stuff like that. I can't do that if I don't post, you get what I'm saying? I gotta get more exposure. So that's what I'm gonna start doing. I just need to balance out my life, like, you know, balance out the businesses, balance out my personal life, balance out YouTube, just get a nice little schedule, you know. But yeah, y'all stay tuned for everything. My house is gonna go fucking crazy. Y'all already know I don't even play when it comes to that Y'all saw my last two apartment tour. Well, the first apartment tour, the second house tour. This one, I'm going crazy, okay? I'm literally going crazy. Like, I can't wait. Um, it's gonna be in my bedroom, an office, and a beauty room. 
office. But the reason I'm not doing the beauty room and office together is because it's two businesses, not one. Like the balloon businesses, the balloon business on its own is going to have a bunch of stuff, a bunch of shelves full of balloons, a bunch of supplies and stuff. And then the sparkly business has its own set of stuff. So, and then I need a desk. And, you know, I just need room to package orders. I need room to build balloons. I need room for all of that. So, therefore, um, that definitely needs to be its own room. Then the beauty room, I plan on getting back into makeup. I'll be doing my hair. I just don't be caring because I don't really got all my stuff like together. But, you know, I plan on doing all of that. I want all my clothes and shoes to be in there. I only want my room to just be straight sleep. Just sleep. Like, I don't really don't even want no dressers in there. But just straight sleep. I won't. Uh-uh. And, yeah, that's the plan. I'm not going to get a dog's in room this time because I've noticed that giving them a room don't do nothing but make me lazy because I'll just lock them in a room. Let them do what they want and then just clean it up whenever I have time or whenever I feel like it. If they're out and about, because think about it, normal people don't have dog rooms for their dogs. Like, let's be real. So, if they're out and about, obviously I'm going to keep them clean. I'm going to keep them on the set schedules where they can use the bathroom and eat and all this other stuff so they don't do it all over the house. And I'm going to have a better schedule, better schedule, so therefore I wouldn't mind them being out. So, I'm going to do it like that. Literally put them on a set schedule, you know, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Or breakfast and dinner. However many times dogs supposed to eat, you know, I'm gonna I'm literally do it like that. Like, don't get uh, ample amount of exercise. They gotta have their own set schedule, you know, or whatever. I'm still gonna be working out when I move. So I really like. I'm ready. I'm ready. I can't wait. I'm leaving everything and everybody behind. Y'all don't mean me no good. <laughs> do you want to race? I ain't gonna race you in this big ass truck. Cause I do your ass sick. Everybody be trying me in this car. I'm trying to tell y'all, like, nobody tried me in Myra. But they be trying it. Like, I won't put this bitch just sport and do the dash. But, yeah, y'all, I'm sorry for rambling. I really was just updating y'all. Let y'all know what's what. So, I'm going to get my salad. Go home and get started on tackling all of this shit. What is all that smoke? I need to get home. I don't got time for this. I'm back home. Got my salad. I'm washing my sheets. Don't trip. But y'all, for some reason, I've I go through phases where I just watch like just certain shit. Mostly stuff that I already saw before. And I'm in my Everybody Hates Chris phase. So <laughs> I literally watch Everybody Hates Chris over and over. It's only four seasons. So after once all the seasons in, I go back. To season one and start over. I don't know why, but I just do. But so after I eat, I'm gonna go get my clothes at the car and we're gonna get started. to get into my real office like it's just i don't know this office it's it ain't spacious enough for me like <laughs> so 
So we're gonna measure how much it is we need. Over this too, just because, like, I just don't be wanting nothing else. They don't care about our stuff, okay? And then tomorrow I'll print the shipping label that actually goes on. Oh, look, my mom got me a dog mom's day gift to go with my um to go with my purse. But anywho, um we are about to pack some more. So I started, oh my God, I didn't even put a dent in this freaking thing. Like, look at this. And it's completely full. I, I don't know what the fuck to do. So I'm gonna type up this box and start putting more oh, of my glassware in it. Cause I am getting very smart about it. Like the color that's in my bedroom, it's going to be the same colors in one of the bathrooms. That way I don't have to buy more stuff, you know? Do it like that. Yeah. I need to get some, um,
sleepy now. Um, I need to clean it up and give me some baby hairs, but only this down. I don't really care about nothing else. Um, so like and comment and subscribe. Oh wait, let me show y'all how to use this, right? So the scrunchie part go in the back. Scrunchy part going to back. Cover your edges. Tie it as tight as you can. And that's that. And it's definitely on there. Go get y'all bonnets, sparkly.com. But thank you so much for watching. I want to take my shower and go to bed. We had a very busy day today. I feel like I could have got a little more done, but I got a lot done. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.